हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वी आर हैविंग अ प्रॉब्लम प्रॉब्लम नंबर 2.4 फ्रॉम पेज नंबर 36 ऑफ स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ एटम ओके इन स्टेटमेंट दे आर सेइंग द वेवलेंथ रेंज ऑफ द विजिबल स्पेक्ट्रम एक्सटेंड्स फ्रॉम वायलेट वायलेट इज हैविंग वेवलेंथ 400 नैनोमीटर टू रेड एंड इट्स हैविंग वेवलेंथ 750 नैनोमीटर and they are asking you to express these wavelengths in frequencies and the frequency should be in hertz okay we know that 1 nanometer equal to 10 raised to power minus 9 meter we are having a wavelength in nanometer so they have given you the conversion so that uh, it will not problematic for you guys okay first of all we should know the given values lambda 1 equal to 400 nanometer they have given you in the statement and lambda 2 equal to 750 nanometer now we have to convert this nanometer into meter so we know that 1 nanometer equal to 10 raised to power minus 9 meter so 400 into 10 raised to power minus 9 meter is your wavelength in meter right now 750 into 10 raised to power minus 9 nanometer has been converted into meter now we will implement the formula to find the frequency we know that nu equal to c upon lambda okay we are having frequency equal to velocity of light divided by wavelength okay now velocity of light you have to remember uh, 3 into 10 raised to power 8 meter per second then now uh, you should put the values to find the new one so new one equal to c that is 3 into 10 raised to power 8 meter per second divided by lambda that is 400 into 10 raised to power minus 9 meter right we will cancel meter with meter okay now i'll write this value as 3 into 10 raised to power 8 second inverse we are having the unit of frequency only 4 into 10 raised to power 2 okay if i'll multiply 4 with the 100 i'll get this value okay now 10 raised to power minus 9 okay now uh, let's simplify these values here we are having plus 2 in a uh, denominator so whenever it will go to the numerator it will turn into minus 2 okay we are having minus 9 in denominator so whenever we will take it to the numerator it will turn into plus 9 okay let's combine the positive values and uh, negative values so 3 into 10 raised to power 8 okay it will be plus 9 and minus 2 divided by 4 when you will divide 3 by 4 you'll get your answer 0.75 okay into uh, now we will minus uh, 2 from 17 so you'll get 10 raised to power 15 second inverse let's simplify it furthermore uh, i'll carry 10 from this value to this value so it will turn into 7.5 into 10 raised to power 14 second inverse this is our new one now find out the value of new 2 that will be c by lambda 2 okay we know the value of velocity of light that is 3 into 10 raised to power 8 meter per second divided by 750 into 10 raised to power minus 9 meter again we will simplify this values so i'll write it as 3 into 10 raised to power 8 meter per second divided by 7.5 into 10 raised to power 2 into 10 raised to power minus 9 meter we will cancel meter with this meter now uh, again we will uh, merge the powers so 3 into 10 raised to power 8 plus 9 minus 2 right divided by 7.5 Whenever you'll divide three by seven point five, you'll get zero point four zero into eight plus nine. That means seventeen minus two. It will be ten raised to power fifteen. Second inverse. Okay. Now I'll uh, carry one ten from this value and give it to this value. So it will be four into ten raised to power fourteen. second inverse now we have to uh, give our answer in hertz i know one thing that one second inverse equal to 1 hertz okay now this value 
will be 7.5 into 10 raised to power 14 hertz and this value will be uh, 4 into 10 raised to power 14 hertz. So, the range of visible spectrum in terms of frequency is from 4 into 10 raised to power 14 hertz to 7.5 into 10 raised to power 14 hertz.